Okay, this is the walkthrough for this weekend's prize Guardian Crossword. First off, first off, uh, ten across uh, is going to be Heath. It's in the words Heartache at Home, Hampstead, Hampstead Heath. And then we've got 13 across. Uh, Apex is going to be 13 across. Ultimately, uh, it's the last letters of those words. Um... And then we've got 14 across, special lorry class. Special means it's an anagram. It's an anagram of lorry, cla uh, lorry class, which is rally cross. Okay, where next? Let's go. Yeah, I mean, 11 and 12 across. I think this is going to have to be bedtime stories. What may help sleep is bedtime stories. And it's Tories. Conservatives is often Tory or Tories when you see it. And the uh, regularly blend, it's the regular letters, missing one out each time, B, E, D. The time, uh, I think it just regularly used. Uh, uh, anyway, moving on. Eight down. Underwear storage in artist's bosom. So... This is going to be chests as for bosoms of drawers is where you put your uh, underwear. But it's chest of drawers means the uh, is the artists. OK, 17 across. Uh, rich fellow being stupid and loud. Well, loud often means the word F as in music. And fellow being stupid means it's an anagram of fellow and then F at the end. And it's well off, which means rich. Mm. Six down, safe at last. So that's the E at last, the last letter of safe. And then that's inside, wrapped in, cloth cut off. So off means it's cloth cut, that's an anagram. And the whole thing means supernatural stuff. And in this, uh, it's the occult. Now, uh, seven down, <clears throat> coins wasted. So wasted means you're all over the place and... So it's an anagram of coins, securing A, so taking A in. Um, a, a better establishment, uh, an establishment for betters, a casino. Okay, now this is a good clue. Five across, you're actually breaking up within the word. So it's the start to with, which is W, and then a word meaning stand, which in this case is easel, and the whole thing is pop goes the weasel so it's weasel okay and then this is an interesting clue yeah bikes initially so that's the b of bikes have come home well if you ride without a saddle we say that you're riding bareback and if you spell it out it's b bikes initially r back have come home so yeah quite a clever little clue that we'll stick it in there we go. Now, municipal rise and fall. We, we had one of these yesterday. It's a palindrome. And in this case, meaning municipal, it's civic. Quite a straightforward one. Where next? Let's go down the bottom. Uh, so, not fast enough for capital in drag. So, if you drag something, you tow it. And if you're not fast enough, you're too slow. And if we... Draw that out, we can see that actually within the word toe, we can put Oslo, a capital, and the whole thing means not fast enough, too slow. Uh, where now? Okay, 22 across. Scholar missing short holiday. Well, uh, hull is short for holiday. And if you take missing, if you take that out of scholar, you're left with what you get as the result of an injury. You get a scar. Now, 18 down. Elaborate clues to a kiss. So we can see an inverted comma there. The A's inside, but we ignore that. It's going to be an anagram of clues to A. Uh, we've got a few letters in already. So if we put them in... Uh, the verb to kiss, uh, we can also say, is to osculate. There we go. If you didn't know that word, there's a 
word of the day. So we can pop that in. Oh, a bit of a rubbish you. Okay, lust after firm check. Well, firm in crosswords often means co for company. And in this case, afterwards, we have a three-letter word for check, which is vet. And the whole thing means covet, lust. You must not covet thy neighbour's wife, as they say. They being the Bible. Uh, 17 down. Get less convincing victory. Uh, protecting the planet. Well, our planet is Earth. We've got a few letters in here. If we put Earth as our planet in there, and we have a win for a victory going outside it, protecting the planet, the planets within it, we get wear thin, which is another way for saying uh, get less convincing. Okay. And I think looking at 16 across... Because it's got a K at the end now, I think it's just going to be nitpick, which is to split hairs. And obviously, if you actually do literally nitpick, you use a fine tooth comb. And feeds well and puts to bed. We're going to open up this bottom corner. That's just going to be something that means feeds well and also means put to bed or puts to bed. And that's going to be tucks in. Okay, what I'm just doing now is I'm just uh, splitting up some of these clues that are multiple words, just with a thicker line, just so we know where the words start and end. It's quite a useful thing to do sometimes. And 15 down there as well. Yeah, if we look at Sex in the City with Fine, City can often mean uh, NY or LA or EC sometimes. In this case, it's NY. Love is often a zero and fine is okay. So if we put N and Y and then we put fine, uh, okay and love inside, we get nooky as a word that means uh, sex. Bit of a lowbrow clue that, but um, we'll let them get away with it. Um, okay, 15 down, little sis. So a little sister is a sis. Uh, so we have sis there and then we have so many when playing, so it's an anagram of so many going inside sis, and the whole thing's going to mean a game, and in this case, the game is Simon Says. Now, award without end pitch. I've been thinking about this one for a, a bit of time, and actually, if you award something, you grant it. Without means going around, a word for d end, which in this case is going to be die. And the whole thing is going to mean pitch, as in, uh, not as in, you know, tone. It's going to mean as in angle of lean. Gradient is the answer there. And then nine across. Prom finale. So that's the M is the finale of prom. Going inside something that means tradition. So it's an eight letter word for tradition which is going to be heritage. So we pop, pop an M in there and we get hermitage, which is a uh, retreat where a hermit would live or a massive museum in St. Petersburg, but I don't think they intended that. Okay, nearly there. Now let's have a look at this one down. I've been thinking about this because this second word Ends end blank blank. What could fit in there? Brain or something? So you have to think of what that second letter could be. Could it be an R? Could it be an L? And then, yeah, it clicked for me that actually what it is is it is an L and it's the Blarney Stone. Is it good to kiss and tell? So if you kiss the Blarney Stone, you get the gift of the gab. So you can talk and tell people. So yeah, quite a bit of a tricky clue that one. Now that gives us 19. I'm surprised solver. So that's you, isn't it? If the setter is talking to you uh, and if you're keeping mum, you aren't saying anything. So you say you don't say. And that whole thing is an expression to say I'm surprised. Which leaves us with 21 down, which actually is a bit of a 
it's just going to be half the word of disgusting, which is going to be tingly, meaning a, a pleasant sensation. I'd probably get worried if I had tingly hands, thinking I was going to have a heart attack or something. I don't necessarily think it would be uh, pleasant, but there we go. And then 27 across is, you see these dots in 26 across, it means it's linked a little bit. So it means it's another word for, it's going to be a city as well. And it's going to be lie about, so it's an anagram of lie, and then after that, uh, another secret. So an anagram of secret after an anagram of lie, and the whole thing's going to mean a city, and that city is Leicester. Which only leaves us with 20 down, and 20 down is a tough one. It's uniform, that often just means a U, but it's the symbol spelled, and that symbol is a colon, and then it says spelled out, so out means it's an anagram of colon, after you, and it means it's square, it's something's uncool, it's a bit square. So we'll pop that in, and we're done. So you can send that in to the Guardian, and hopefully you might win a prize. Uh, so there we go. Hope you enjoyed that one, and uh, we'll just fix this eye, and we'll see you next time.